Hello friends, today we are going to read Water Dance. The author is Sean DeMello. The illustrator is Ajanta Guhatakarta and the publisher is Pratham Books. So let's read Water Dance. So what do you think this story is about? Is it about dancing on water? or dancing with water? Let's read the story and find out. Guddu loves to dance. He dances to the cow mooing and to the sound of someone eating. So this is Guddu. He is this boy and it looks like he likes to dance. Look at his feet. You can see that he is moving and his hands are also moving. And what is he, this? This is the cow that is moving and he is dancing to that sound. There is no music. He doesn't seem to need any music. He is just listening to the sound of the cow moving and he is dancing to it. And he is also dancing to the sound of someone eating. Drip, drip, drop, 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 gush, gush. Water, you are full of beads. Let's see what else you can do. So what do you see in this picture? This woman is eating this watermelon and when she is eating the watermelon can you hear the sound sometimes when somebody is eating something crunchy something juicy do you hear them yes right and you can hear them and you can hear a beat a sound that keeps repeating at the same gap of time and here this man is washing this fruit and the sound of that water from the tap is also splashing down and you can hear the beat, the sound. And based on that beat, it looks like Guddu likes to dance. Swish, swash, swish, swash. Slow down, stream. I can't keep up with you. So here there is this stream of water and it is bubbling along. So when that sound is made by the stream, Guddu hears a beat there too. And you can see he is hearing the beat and he is moving his arms. He is moving his feet. He is dancing to that beat. Burble, 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 burble. I wonder if a river would have a gentler beat. I could bounce about with the river. So here in this picture, there is a river. This is in Guddu's mind. He is imagining a river instead of the stream and he is thinking, will the river be gentler? Will it be flowing slower? And he could dance with that beat. Whoosh, boom, bash. The ocean may look calm, but the waves must be wild and loud. So what do you see here? This is the beach. Have you heard the ocean waves at the beach? Swoosh is the sound you can hear, right? And along with that sound, the waves are wild and loud. And so Guddu is shaking his head to that beat. Puff, 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 puff. Nothing can be louder than this rain. These raindrops are quick and fast. 
So here, what do you see? It's raining and the raindrops are coming down very fast and he hears that sound too. Guddu hears that sound and it is repeating at a regular time, making a beat and Guddu is dancing in the puddles to that beat. Whoosh, fizz. Whoosh, fuzz. Oh, waterfall, you are quite loud too. So here is a waterfall. The waterfall also makes a sound when the water splashes and falls down. And Guddu likes to dance to that too. Mom is skipping stones by the pool. Maybe the pool has a tune too. So here is Guddu's mother. She is skipping stones. She is throwing the stone so that it bounces on the surface of the pool and it makes that sound splash 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 every time it touches the water that also has a tune skippity 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 plop so here is good do having a great time dancing to the sound of this water. Why are you dancing, Guddu? Everyone asks. There's no music. There is music and there is rhythm. Just listen to the water. So here are Guddu's friends. They're all asking him, what are you dancing to? I don't hear any music. There is no music around. So how are you able to dance? And Guddu tells them, there is music everywhere. If you listen to the water, there is a rhythm to it. There is a beat. And you can dance to that too. You just have to listen. And here you can see Guddu's friends are also dancing with him to all the sounds they hear around them. I hope you enjoyed this story. Thank you. The difficult words in this story are beat, the steady sound or pulse you hear in some sound or music, rhythm, a steady sound that repeats at the same gap of time. Try these questions. What are all the different beats that Guddu hears and dances to in this story? Can you give some examples of other sounds you hear around you that you can dance to? If you like, you can record these sounds or even record yourself dancing to these sounds and share with us.